the thing that has really changed is that we see an increasing number of people from other continents coming into Europe. For the last four centuries, roughly before the Second World War, it was Europeans who moved out of Europe to conquer and to settle and occupy foreign territories, particularly in the Americas, but also in Africa and Asia. So this was the era of colonialism. So it was always Europeans moving out. Now, after the Second World War, with decolonization and fast growth in Europe, and also declining birth rates and slowing down of population growth, those patterns reversed. So Europe has become from the global source of migrants to the global destination of migrants. That had also consequences for the traditional countries of European settlement, principally the United States of America, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, because their traditional source of immigrants was Europe. But with Europe itself becoming prosperous and a destination for migrants itself, Europe sort of dried up as a global source of migrants. Basically, it meant that migration to Canada, the US, Australia and New Zealand became decreasingly European and increasingly Asian and Latin American. Migration as such not. I mean, take a country like the Netherlands. In, in the 16th and 17th century, there were incredibly high numbers of people coming to the city of Amsterdam and to the big cities of the Netherlands more generally. And that is true for many uh, countries that have been very influential. So again, we have seen times in, in, a, in a history farther away of big immigration, although from a European perspective, most of those migrations were migrations from within Europe, so from other European countries, for instance, to the Netherlands or to the UK or to France. Uh, and I think the thing that has really changed is that we see an increasing number of people from other continents coming into Europe. But again, these are not staggering numbers, uh, but it's unprecedented in terms of increasing diversity in particularly the big cities of Europe. But on a global scale, we can't really say that migration is spinning out of control or there are much bigger numbers uh, than in the past. Mm -hmm.